said something stinky. <laughs> Look at her. Let me show me. She's like, come on, mom. You are. You smell it? Yeah. Um, I don't know. It just smells like moldy mildew outdoor food. Yeah. Let me see how you do. <laughs> okay. Costco Business Center. Oh, I haven't been in here in ages. All right, I wanted to share with you guys what is the difference between a regular Costco and a business Costco because not every area has a business Costco. So, of course, you have these things as well, like regular Costco has this. But although I went to my regular Costco yesterday, they're not, they don't have the same sale items. Um, but what you do have is Oreo sandwich cookies, like the whole, uh, what do you call that, crate is... 999 usually it's 1499 you save 500 dollars with all those oreo cookies and then also along with that like dinner napkins 518 673 and all that stuff so um and then refrigerators like this one is industrial so that's a big difference so this is a commercial commercial refrigerator which i actually like to be honest i want a commercial refrigerator Huh, interesting. Why not have a commercial refrigerator? You know, hmm, interesting. Okay, so, so you got different refrigerators. Here you go, commercial, but then you got also this for your business. This one, we see this all the time, right? So this is, Mom, yes. Mom, in your kitchen. That's right, for my kitchen. So you got this for your restaurant or your business and it's um not bad for 2500 yes I, yes love um extra burner did not see that and then you got these um again for your restaurant what is this one floor model what is this adjustable shelves huh interesting okay what is this um dishwasher oh that's a dishwasher and then you got your sink you could even put this into your um, mud room or your laundry room if you had wanted one really cheap 244 okay came in here for a specific reason like this and they did have it now um you can use these for these the food warmer but i want to see um because it has a it has it has um tag price but I wanted to um, I've been making my homemade ice cream I haven't filmed it I haven't shown you guys but I made it twice actually turned out really good so I wanted to put it in here to be able to put it into the freezer okay wash bin all this stuff that's good for your your business um, soup warmer this is um they got um, this one which is where the wearing pretty good brand um, I hope you guys wanted to open up a, a business and you're one, wondering where should you get the um, the supplies. Well, here you go. Um, to make um, frozen drinks, dispensers, chairs, high chairs from restaurants. Those brown chairs are very popular. Brown high chairs, that's where they get it from. Oh, there it is. This is what I was looking for. So... Okay, I'm going to get one here. So it's $7 for this size. And I actually want to get this one for um, ice cream. But, well, it's by the exit, so I want to see. I don't want to overbuy, but I just want to know that at least it's here. And <laughs> heavy. if you needed an immersion blender, that's so big. But, okay, and then, oh my goodness, what is this? cold beverage dispenser oh and it's only 42 okay got that uh, oh this one if i had my macarons i needed to um a display case that's the display case so the display case is 79 perfect for a little a little bakery then you got your big pots you got your different coffee makers. Yeah. And then um, you got your, what do you call these? Uh, stove. 
And oh, there you go. Skillet 27, but it's um, non stick on the inside, but it's very, very heavy. Then you got your dinnerware plates, and they're all white with the plastic. A lot of restaurants, whatever, you know, like the stuff that you see at the restaurants seems to be where they would find it. I've also seen these around, so even I forgot what it is like, um, like fast food places so that's where you get them and then I need these they're like only like these big bowls now very nice and light oh wow it's a big bowl and then you got the different vacuums and these are the commercial upright ones if you had a cleaning business or again if you had a business where you needed um, commercial vacuum and then here you go with um, the carts, like the different carts. This is 119, and then you buy just those um, your cookie sheets, and then it just goes in there. That's what that's for. Um, nice table, stainless steel. Okay, well, and now of course you got your registers, you got your printers, and um, security camera, and what else? Basically, you got everything in here to basically start your business. You got your indoor temperature LED clock right on it. Um, what else? Lots of um, computers, all that stuff. Tapes, fire extinguishers. And then this is where you would get like time cards. If you were still doing the manual time cards, sales orders, guest check-in. Um, Lots of tape, envelopes, pens, sharpies. Here we go. Office supplies, inks. Then you got your gloves, uh, different type of gloves to handle food or vinyl gloves. You got poly gloves, you got uh, nitrile gloves. Then you got, what are these? Ooh pastry sandwich bag oh that's pretty cool hmm you put your um, little brown bags in there or the little brown bags hmm. yeah I like that I like that 30 bucks but still if I if I was to use a lot of it you know like if I make my cookies and sell my cookies cleaning supplies um, not just regular cleaning supplies but professional grade <laughs> when I when I see those I think about um, Dexter we used to watch Dexter okay so that containers the flop but it's just um, right, they have deli containers uh, $45 or $26.59 Oh, these are nice. Look how big the boxes are, but $32, 200 count craft takeout box. Hmm. Good to know where it's at, if I needed it, but just basically a business Costco it just has um, lots of boxes apparently, but to go containers, 200 to 100 counts. And these are for your warming the food, foil. No, I don't know. There's nothing really to show you guys because it's just rows and rows of big boxes of plates and cups and all those things over here. And then um, you got one, two, three, four, five aisles of different kinds of drinks. Uh, if you were to sell your drinks at your restaurant. Um, they have all the drinks, all five rows of drinks. All the drinks uh, they offer. So, the refrigerated aisles though is like four times bigger than the regular Costco because then you have all the restaurants coming in here and getting their, their supplies of tomatoes um, and such, you know, um, broccoli, what is this, lettuce. See the lettuce, $16 and it's, um, a box 
compared to the regular Costco. Ooh, it's cold, Danica. Ooh, I don't tend to come here as much because it just doesn't, you know, meet my needs for my family. But um, look, you got <clears throat> you got pico de gallo that's in these huge containers, and look at this one, beef dinner pranks, dinner franks, hot dogs. So you got all these hot dogs over here, little cups, um, salsa. You got salsa de verde over here in this big tub container. You've got uh, mozzarella in this huge bag, obviously. Look, all these cheese. Aisles and aisles of cheese. Potato salads. Yes, my love. Danica's like, yeah, let's get out of here. Honey butter. Cinnamon honey butter. Oh, with cinnamon and brown sugar. Garlic butter. What are these? Salted whipped butter. Uh, different kinds of butter for you to bake using um, their ingredients. Sour cream, huge. But um, you've got all these butters. See all these butters? There's nothing but aisles of butter. You want to get out, my love? Oh, $6.99 for this. One, two, three, four, five, six. Look at all those um, eggs. Danica's getting cold. Okay, lovely. Okay, love you. You getting cold? Let's get out of here, she said. <laughs> I don't blame you. Okay, let's go. And then over here is where they have cased of meats. So if you needed to buy a lot of meat, um, it would be over there for parties and stuff. That's good for parties. I've checked out before. Look at all the potatoes. Potatoes and onions. If you needed onions, big bags of onions here. And again, the dairy, more dairies there. There's the milk, uh, big aisle, big area for the dairy. Um, you've got all the milks in there and coffee creamers and, and stuff. And then over there was the box meat, fresh produce. 